Resiliency is the name of the game for the Southern Ohio Copperheads as they find a way to win their fourth consecutive game tonight, taking down the Xenia Scouts by a final score of 7-6. to six. Now, Jake, in this ballgame, Southern Ohio jumps out 3-0 in the first inning. The offense looked terrific at that point. Then everything kind of slowed down. Uh, Blake Bottoms kept Xenia at bay until the relief pitching came in. They kind of blew this one as Southern Ohio fell behind 6-3. to three. But then uh, Xenia helped a little bit, a few walks, a, a few clutch at bats from the Copperheads, and then one big swing by Dan Schmidt as a, as a solo home run in the top of the ninth led to the 7-6 finish. Huge win for the Copperheads. Yeah, definitely. And they jumped out to that 3-0 lead early, you know, got a few hits in that, you know, big first inning. Uh, took a big lead, but slowly the scouts, you know, got back into this game. Blake Bottoms was very good as a starting pitcher for the Copperheads. He went six innings, uh, gave up only three hits, two runs, four strikeouts, kept the walks down, had good control, and looked very good. The bullpen struggled, and it went, you know, you went down 6-3 to three late in the game, and you thought, you know, maybe that was the dagger. This team came right back. Back, took advantage of you know some walks was were very patient at the plate some good at bats and, and you know and were able to tie the game up and then you know Dan Schmidt with that blast in the ninth and you know this was another good win for this team on the road they sweep the road trip now even more importantly and they're, they're they've won four in a row and they're pretty much you know picking up steam you know we can knock on the bullpen a little bit today but the one thing I will say is that the back end of that bullpen was fabulous again as you bring in Josh Rader and then Eric Shanahan and they both shut the door after the Copperheads took the lead 7-6, to six, so that was great to see. After the game, we talked to Blake Bottoms and also Dan Schmidt, and they told us about what it means to win this ball game. It was very important. I mean, we, we had four uh, really tough games right here, and, you know, we kind of saw everything that you can in a baseball game. You know, I was cruising for a while, and then, you know, bullpen comes in, kind of gets shaky, but, you know, Dan picked us up, and Josh and Eric closed it out. It was a good job. We're starting to come together as a team and starting to figure each other out, and, uh, Infield starting to play a little better. I know that's been down a little bit, and basically I think that we're going to be a pretty good team this summer. Four wins in a row means the Copperheads are 8-5 and five on the regular season, and again, they're moving their way up in the GLSCL standings. The next time they'll be in action will be Friday and Saturday as they have a, a little bit of a homestand. They take on the Lake Erie Monarchs. Look for some revenge, a team that beat them earlier this year. You can catch the broadcast, as always, on copperheadbaseball.com or on Power 105 in Athens. And also, as we always say, check into all the media that we give you. Most importantly, our YouTube page, search Co Copperheads Baseball. But with that being said, he's Jacob Corgan. I'm Ryan Boyd, and this has been a Copperheads Recap.